Hello. Scanning. Neural imaging shows your mental resources are great. This should help. You should feel more alert. Hello. Diagnosing. Looks like you've had a rough day. This won't take long. Good as this. Please fill out a patient experience questionnaire so I can serve you better next time. I can help you. I didn't see you there. Dr. Thorstein, where are you? Machine shop, I was just... I, I heard an explosion. Forget that. Grab whatever you can and get to my office. We're evacuating. What? What should I... Neuromods, exotic material, just hurry. Meet me in my office. Yes, sir. And bring a glue gun. In light of what we now know the Typhon are capable of, and not capable of, it seems prudent to revisit the Project Cobalt material. 
Igor, neuromods can already adapt Titan material to the human mind. There's no reason in principle the reverse wouldn't work. Say you manage to insert human neurons into a Typhoon. How will you know it was successful? The new neural structures would need to mature over a series of actual experiences. Or simulated ones. What? Simulate the experiences. Calvino. He has... Right, okay, look, it's fascinating, but let's focus on what we know is working. I don't want anyone devoting resources to this. Hello, Dr. Yu. Fascinating. There's something almost angelic about those golden filaments, like frozen light. The Typhon weave it out of thin air. The question is why? We have a lot of theories, but no solid answers. Not yet. I wish you were with me, Morgan. Not the way you are now. The way you used to be. I know we could tackle this together. Like old times. More specimens required.
Hello, Dr. Yu. to my conference room. Eh? What? Oh, 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 y yes. <laughs> I was uh, just about to call you. All I see is a dot. Yes, that's right. It's the calibration system for the new touchscreen. You only have to run it one time. Ugh, are you kidding me? <clears throat> just follow the dot. When it turns green, touch it. It should... Damn it, Calvino. I do not have time to play sing-along with your bouncing ball. I'll call you back.
Over here. What, you need guns? Ammo? I saw one of them science types going to that armory. Saw him punching the code. Uh, you get me out of here. I'll let you have it. M my name's Aaron. Aaron Ingram. Come on now, I've got... Now that's what I'm talking about. Some human decency, friend. You're the one person that showed me any real kindness, and you can believe I won't forget it. Well, if you still want that code, it's 8714. Listen, you run into any other fellas wearing a green jumpsuit? Watch your ass. Well, they ain't all decent human beings like me.
starting here. I was afraid of this. The scientists here were in the middle of something when they died. Access to the gut is closed off during experiments. Security protocol. You'll have to finish what they started. Back in the 60s and 70s, the first research teams tried to communicate with the Typhon. But this proved impossible. Their cerebral structures are highly developed and intentional, but somehow unapproachable. They have no speech of their own, no language. They don't seem to even see us. Not like we see ourselves, I mean. I'm generalizing when I say us. Of course, I'm not a person. Not like you. Live exam procedure in progress. Local lockdown in effect until procedure terminates. People are quick to project human features onto things they don't understand. The Typhon kill us without hesitation. But it's not because they're evil. It's because they can't do otherwise. Do you know what we discovered? They lack mirror neurons. All their wonderful abilities, there's one thing we can do that they can't. Empathize with the suffering of another living creature. that breach. I met it out there as we speak. What do you think happened? Hard to say until I lay eyes on it. Could be some micrometeoroids punched a hole. Rare, but it happens. Okay, good. Hopefully it's just that. Is there something you're not telling me? No, of course not. It's just that storage room has classified exotic materials. We really can't have it be inaccessible. Uh, I understand. Eradicator auto turrets. Transstar's last ditch defense against an outbreak. Flimsy. But they're easy to fabricate. Best part is the built-in psychoscope tech. They can discriminate between alien and human targets. Shouldn't be a problem for you. Since you're not an alien. 